Some people may wonder what helps contribute to a resilient Chinese economy in the teeth of the coronavirus outbreak. The answer may lie in the homebody economy or Jai economy. The homebody economy often refers to on-demand streaming services such as online shopping, fresh food delivery, online education and gaming apps that can satisfy people's demands in the comfort of their own homes. The trend is obvious in the e-commerce sector. During the epidemic period, the once budding industry for millennials has now become a lifeline for stay-at-homes. According to a report by UK-based consulting firm Kantar, of 1,093 Chinese consumers it surveyed, 84% have sampled new consumption patterns during the outbreak. Despite lounging in their beds or sofas, people still can whip out their phones, visit online to offline catering platforms, and make group buys with a single click. JD Fresh, the fresh food arm of Chinese e commerce giant JD, said its sales grew by 215% year on year from January 24th to February 2nd, with more than 15,000 tons of fresh products sold nationwide. Another fresh food delivery app, Miss Fresh, has seen its orders surge by 300% year-on-year during the epidemic outbreak. Also, the popularity of telecommuting apps targeted at those working from home or taking online classes has pumped up China's digital economy. Some telecommuting platforms developed by tech giants such as Alibaba, Tencent and Huawei were suddenly catapulted into the ranks of China's most downloaded apps. Tencent said demand for work from home and online teaching programs rose 10 times on February the 10th, when much of the country officially came back from an extended spring festival holiday. Over 20 online education agencies have rolled out free courses for students since the epidemic. In addition, telemedicine is also all the rage. Online health platforms including Ali Health, Tencent Health and Dr. Lilac have launched free consultation services, with which people can get preliminary diagnosis from thousands of doctors across the country. According to Ali Health, as of January 30th, more than 2.8 million people visited the platform. Simply put, on average, each online doctor received more than 100 patients every day. The virus outbreak may have taken a toll on some consumption sectors, but China's highly developed online sector helps soften the blow. S&P Global Rating said that the outbreak is expected to help China further the long-term structural shift to an online economy. The homebody economy, an undisputed proof of this structural shift, is witnessing how China's digital economy hatches economic risks and offsets coronavirus impact.